Disappointing. Uh, given what her staff said about the Catholic faith, about an attempt to subvert it, uh, there should have been a statement right at the start saying, I disown everything that was read in those emails, and I'm not going to try to defend them. Uh, we should not let any Catholicism in any form enter into the political campaigns of either candidate. Uh, very disappointing, and I hope Mrs. Clinton will turn around and say she cannot tolerate any Catholic bigotry in her campaign, and at the same time, as she did last night, quote, John, uh, quote Pope Francis, defending her positions on ecology and the like. You can't have it both ways. Either you respect all religions or you think that you're superior to them and you can make use of mm. unfortunate bigotry to try and downplay. The fact that someone baptizes their child a Catholic becomes a subject of discussion on a campaign, I, I find this horrendous. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. And, yeah. and as uh, Cardinal Dolan pointed out, if, if that kind of uh, derisive comment was directed towards any other world religion, it would be jumped all over immediately. Some, for some reason, it seems like it's okay uh, to say these sorts of things about Christians or Catholics in the world, it seems. Uh, but you, you really took offense to the fact that she evoked Pope Francis at the end. I got upset because the night before she depended, uh, defended partial birth abortion, she told us that it's completely just between a doctor and, her, and a woman. And, uh, wait a minute, what about the baby? Pope Francis defends the right to life, and yet she called on him last night defending her position on ecology and global warming and economic inequality. Look, if you want to turn to the Pope for advice, read everything he says. And, you know, Donald Trump has said quite clearly he's pro-life. Catholics are heartened by that. I wish Hillary Clinton would change her position, but at least don't try and pretend that the Pope is endorsing her in some way by quoting him selectively. Uh, it's, it's not good. Uh, partial birth abortion is a horrendous crime. It should end. Most Americans are in favor of that uh, ending. Uh, her defense of it last uh, two nights ago really upset me because we're talking about babies here. I hear this line, it's for the children. Everything's for the children. Children being born, in the process of being born, it is not any medical treatment to kill them. She defended that the other night. That was very upsetting.